Hey everyone, either welcome back or welcome to my channel. And in today's video, I want to talk about how I think that people who achieve remission with IIH, especially through weight loss, have just as tough of a time with the condition as those people who have to get in longer term solutions like shunts and stents. So before I get into any more details about this, time for the intro. I think when it comes to the different paths that IIH can go down, whether people need to maintain shunts and with stents and all of that, people think that weight loss is the easiest solution. I'm going to make an argument and say, I don't think this is the case. This doesn't mean that I'm not saying that living with a shunt isn't hard. I do have friends that have shunts and the amount of times that they have to go in for medical procedures because the shunt malfunctions is ridiculous. It's one of the reasons why I didn't want to have to go down that path. But as I've gotten closer to remission with weight loss, I think that this is also a really difficult thing because if you achieve remission with the condition, in this particular way, no rhyming intended, I believe that you have as equally as tough of a time because maintaining weight loss is so difficult. It's really, really difficult to do. So if it is something that's related to weight, I don't know how even medical professionals can say this is the easy way out. It's not easy maintaining weight, especially once you've gained a lot of weight and had to lose it because your body does seem to like to burn a certain amount of calories a day. And there's often reasons too as to why people gain weight that are not just we're eating too much and moving too little. So there's a whole complexity there and maintaining weight loss is extremely difficult. Talk to anyone who's lost weight and tried to keep it off. There's a reason why a majority of people fail to keep it off in the longer term. I was one of them. I've lost weight a couple of times now and gained it back. And I even was at the weight that I'm currently at right now went up even higher than what I was when I was lost weight that first time, what is what I was diagnosed with when I was diagnosed with IIH and had to lose weight again. Losing weight and now having it linked to a, a medical condition that makes me non-functional basically is enough of a motivation that gaining weight is still one of my probably one of my biggest fears at this point. When I start feeling really not so good at all and I start missing workouts or there's a reason why I'm missing workouts and I'm not able to get in my workouts or if I notice that my diet is really, really bad, I get so nervous for myself because I know that gaining weight will make things worse. My worst fear is having my swelling and my optic nerves come back up and risking my vision once again. And to say that weight loss is the easiest thing, I think is downplaying this situation for a lot of people with IIH who do achieve, achieve remission in this particular way. Unfortunately though, for those of us who do live with migraines as well, we can be fighting the migraine symptoms and that can make it hard to keep the weight off and all of that because when you have a migraine, you basically can't get out of bed. And I really wish that people who talk to us and even medical professionals in this case would not make it sound like losing weight is a 
the cure. Is this really the easy way out when I have to maintain weight, which is we know is one of the hardest things to do in the end anyways? It just makes me question this as to how much some people understand or don't understand about how hard it is to maintain weight loss. And this is where I think there's a lot of blame that's put on the patient when, you know, we do gain weight back. I would say that losing weight for me was the easiest part. This isn't the patient's fault that they have had this happen to them. And I wish that it wasn't made to be out like it's the patient's fault because it isn't. And there's a lot of pressure that's put on people who lose weight, especially when you have a medical condition. And it's not fair that so much guilt is forced upon people who are have lost weight. It's one of my biggest fears is gaining weight back. And it's one of the biggest concerns that I have actually is gaining weight back. But I feel like out of everything with IIH, this is being treated as the easy solution when in reality that this is actually quite a difficult thing to maintain. If you are enjoying the content, I strongly encourage you to subscribe so that we can reach more people and have more awareness for IIH. While you're hitting that subscribe button, make sure you also hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming new content. Be sure to give this video a like if you enjoyed it. If you're watching this on Facebook or Instagram, be sure to like and follow. And as for now, that's it for today. Bye everyone.